Hey guys, what's going on? Savage Dan here. Playing some BF4 today. I got asked to use my favorite loadout. And my favorite loadout, of course, is Assault. Gun-wise, it's Ace-23. I love it with my Coyote Sight, Tribeam Laser, uh, Flash Hider, and Angled Grip. And I love my MP443 with Tribeam Laser and uh, Heavy Barrel. Probably the best um, hit fire in the game for pistol-wise. But uh, then, you know, I have my defib and my medic bag. Now, I found something cool today. I don't know if this is something a lot of people know. I sure as hell didn't fucking know about it. Um, but apparently, if someone's dead in front of you, and you're a medic, you can look at their body, press E. I'll show you right now. I'm going to go press E on this guy. This is what happens. Oh, of course, no, it's not working. That's what happens. You bring out your defibs, it charges in enough to get an initial charge to, to revive. And then after, it just automatically revives a person with pressing heat. I don't know if it's something a lot of people know or not. Um, I figured out by every time I was, if there was like a dead guy on an MCOM when I went to go arm it, I would arm the MCOM and revive the guy at the same time. And I was like, what the hell is happening? So I ended up testing it on just a dead body nowhere near anything like look oh no i accidentally hit three muscle memory told me hit three but it's kind of cool that that's a thing uh i didn't know there was a guy in that corner because it just makes it quicker you don't have to hit three then charge it up it automatically brings it out charges it and actually defibs a person as fast as it can uh with giving itself a charge so it's a pretty awesome idea by DICE. Uh, those little things that, you know, you might not notice that are in the game are pretty awesome. Because, like I said, I had no idea and I'm a rank 105. That's not something you just normally notice. Because it's such a small detail. But such a big detail at the same time. What are you doing? Why am I allowed to get killed from there, teammates? But I wonder if there's more stuff out there like that that people don't know about. Like, I wonder if a tank needs repair, you can just hit E and your repair torch comes out or something like that. Or if someone needs ammo, you run up to them and click E and it throws it back. These are all things I'm going to have to try now that I found this little slice of heaven. Uh, sir? Whoa, where was that guy going? <laughs> I think that was a bad guy. Was that a, or a... I think that was a friendly that decided to run into three guys instead of running backwards. He's like, I got it, coach. I'll kill them all. And I died in second. See, now the question is, do I go outside and stop the coming through out there, or do I come inside? That was a bad idea. I don't think my team is the brightest bunch. Pretty sure I'm on the retarded side. Which always sucks. If you're an above average player, or at least a decent player, you get stuck on the side with retards. I think you all know my feeling. It's kind of frustrating. Why are you allowed to be in there? What the fuck? See, they should not be able to get to that room that easy. So, I'm pretty sure I'm on the dumb team. Of course, no one's watching outside. Because, you know, obviously that's not important. I'm gonna go outside. I'm gonna flank him. We just have to hold him for four tickets. It's not a lot, but still. Actually, I'm gonna say that is a lot if your team is that bad. So.
Is this guy really shooting at me right now? If he killed me, I would have fucking screamed and cried like a little bitch. Why are you camping there? Honestly. Why is my guy sliding like a f Oh, because you spawned on me. Thanks, buddy. You just got me killed. Little does he know. How did they get the alpha? That's the harder thing. Assist after kill assist after kill assist after kill assist. My bullets just didn't want to kill me, but I'm dead. Woo! I didn't do that good that game, I don't think. I don't know, we'll find out. I did okay. But uh yeah, thank you guys for watching. It's a little short one today. Um, that's my favorite class loadout on any map. I would love to use that gun. Um, it's so accurate, so powerful, such a good fire rate that it's, it's almost like the M16 from, um, BF3. I think the LED5 is more the M16 from BF3. I just don't like using that gun. Um, it's a little bit more harder to control. And to be honest, uh... Uh, I don't know. I just like the, the Ace-23 better after using it for a while. But uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned that little tip with uh, hitting E on a, a guy that needs revived. Uh, like I said, I didn't know that. I just accidentally figured it out. But uh, make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, share it with your friends. I'm almost at 300 subscribers. Uh, kind of excited. But uh, yeah, make sure to share it with your friends. I will see you guys tomorrow with another episode of Weaponology. So uh, have a good Tuesday. See you guys later.